Hey, it's Joe Fear from GetThriveCart.com, and in this video, we're going to kind of debunk one of the more common questions we receive in our support and in our uh, Facebook groups is all about, hey, what type of membership platforms are supported with ThriveCart? So what kind of stuff integrates with ThriveCart's platform to, you know, so someone buys using ThriveCart, a customer is added to their membership site online where they can then access their all, all their you know paid materials the content and things like that so in this video we're going to talk about the native integrations what's offered right now natively in thrivecart but then we're also going to talk about various other ways to integrate so basically at the end of the day thrivecart will support almost any platform out there because there's so many ways to integrate so let's get into it now and explain how to do it so first off, why even use a membership platform in the first place? So if you don't know, membership platforms are great to house all of your content online. So you can even give away free content or it could be paid content. And this is just where you would plug that content online. Typically, it's a secure type of content place. So there's a login sent to your customer. So then, you know, they can then log in and then access the content that they purchased. Uh, this makes you look a lot more professional. So you can definitely, you know, obviously just put it on a web page somewhere and kind of hide the URL, but that's not as professional. Um, it's not as secure, obviously, and it it's difficult to manage, really. So that's what all these things do. And then obviously you can manage your members within these membership platforms as well. So that it's kind of like a, a content management, member management CRM. And last off, you can grow a list with subscribers and buyers and obviously offer them a piece of content to kind of uh, in exchange for that. So the native membership integrations that Thrivecart offers currently, and this is just as of making this video, uh, do know that Thrivecart is always adding in new membership integrations and they'll continue to do that for much further than now. Um, so obviously if you get in earlier, you know, you're going to get grandfathered in at the best price and then get all of these new integrations uh, added to your uh, software, to your, to your account. But do you know, these are just the native integrations where they're the simplest to set up. So right now it's wishlist member, digital access pass, member mouse, optimize member, teachable, and member press. Member press is actually the newest one um, that, that was in high demand. So was teachable and wishlist members kind of like a, um, you know, a lot of people know that one as well. So these are kind of like the biggies and this accomplishes pretty much 80% of the different membership platforms out there, which is cool because they're very simple to set up and it integrates perfectly in Thrivecart where it'll pass over, you know, all the member, uh, members information into your CRM as well. So you can have all that stuff stored in the database there. All right, so let's get into actually how to set up these integrations inside of Thrivecart. I just want to give you a quick look. Okay, you can see here we're inside the Thrivecart dashboard. So if you go to settings tab on top, you can see your list of all sorts of settings here. We're going to go to the membership platform. And these right here are all the natively integrated platforms that we currently have inside of Thrivecart as of recording this video. Obviously, more are going to happen and, and keep popping in uh, as, we, as time goes on. But you can see each one of these kind of have their own individual way to integrate. So for us in our account, we integrate with Teachable. And you can see right here, it's it's um, we can actually add more than one, which is really cool. And this is the case with all of them is Thrivecart will not limit you to the number of integrations that you have. So you might have a Teachable account. You might also have a digital access pass account. You could see I have the option to actually integrate with these guys if I wished right now. Or, you know, maybe it's a member press site or something like that. Um, or you can have multiple of the same. So that's what's really cool. Don't feel like you're ever going to be limited at all. And each one of these have their own instructions on how to integrate using Thrivecart. Okay, you can see here we're inside the Thrivecart dashboard. So if you go to settings tab on top, you can see your list of all sorts of settings here. We're going to go to the membership platform. And these right here are all the natively integrated platforms that we currently have inside of Thrivecart as of recording this video. Obviously, more are going to happen and, and keep popping in uh, as, we, as time goes on. But you can see each one of these kind of have their own individual way to integrate. So for us in our account, we integrate with Teachable. 
and you can see right here it's it's um, we can actually add more than one which is really cool and this is the case with all of them is Thrivecart will not limit you to the number of integrations that you have. So you might have a Teachable account. You might also have a Digital Access Pass account. You could see I have the option to actually integrate with these guys if I wished right now. Or you know maybe it's a member press site or something like that. Um, or you can have multiple of the same. So that's what's really cool. Don't feel like you're ever gonna be limited at all. And each one of these have their own instructions on how to integrate using Thrivecart. Okay, so let's just say that your membership platform isn't one of those natively integrated softwares that we just uh, that, that we just looked at. Another option is to integrate via an API. And what this basically means is that membership sites will sometimes have APIs and integrations on their end that then connect to third-party softwares outside of their system. And there are membership sites that do that for Thrivecart. So some of those right now, and there probably are more than just these, these are what we're aware of right now, is Membersonic, and also another one is called Everlesson. So basically those you would have to connect from Membersonic or Everlesson's side, and then API integrate into Thrivecart, and then it'll achieve the same thing. Another option is using Zapier. So Zapier is basically this tool that is built inside of Thrivecart. It's completely built in there with deep integrations. Um, you actually have like this kind of tool chest of recipes that you can slap together uh, with triggers and then kind of a thing that happens after that. And what you can do is integrate with membership sites using that. So if it's offered inside of Zapier, your, your membership platform, you can basically integrate it with Thrivecart. And this is again, very, very, very simple. You can actually go into the integrations area inside of Thrivecart and then check that out. So some options there are Teachable and Kajabi, and there's a bunch more. The list literally goes on in Zapier forever and ever. It's really, really cool. It's a great, great asset to use inside of Thrivecart. Now here's a look at Thrivecart's Zapier recipe book, we'll call it. Um, and this is inside of the settings tab, again, inside of Thrivecart. And you'll notice all the Zapier integrations. And basically, once you figure out a trigger, so once you set your trigger over here, so maybe it's a purchase, you can then set up an action. And based on that action, you can add them to various different platforms, built-in apps and whatnot. And just search up your tools inside of here and you know, you'll have a million options of different things to choose from. Now the last one is integration with your autoresponder. So this is a little different. So this is when someone can get added to your membership site based on their email address. And what that kind of does is it, it allows you to kind of use the built-in tagging inside of Thrivecart to add people to the various membership platforms out there. And you can kind of use the behavioral rules um, add, remove to membership levels, things like that. That's really what Thrivecart's built off of are these rules and these different types of tagging. So like what happens when someone does what purchase or maybe a cancellation, things like that. That's the add, remove rules. And that's how people can actually get added to your membership site as well. So um, if your software, if your membership software has integration that's directly uh, with the autoresponder and using emails to add to that software, this could be a really good option for you. And this is pretty popular as well. And you'll be able to achieve exactly what you need to do. So some examples of membership platforms that do that are iMember360, that's a big one. So is Active Member 360 and Memberium. So it's kind of a lot. There's tons of ways to integrate. Um, native integrations are obviously the easiest, and those are the ones that are built into Thrivecart themselves, like we were saying. It's about 80%. All the biggies are covered there, and more are gonna continue to be added. We're literally in the early stages of Thrivecart. Uh, so the earlier you get in now, obviously you're gonna get a better price on purchasing Thrivecart but you're gonna get grandfathered in for all of those integrations that are coming in the future. And you can always suggest a software that you might not see. They actually have a whole features request uh, website, uh, Thrivecart does, where you can vote up different things that people would like to see inside of Thrivecart to see built out. Um, so that's an option if you don't see a software in there natively integrated yet. Another way to integrate is using APIs. 
And this is again on the membership side of things. So that's when you tap into Thrivecart from the membership software side, not through uh, Thrivecart. So API integrations are an option. Zapier integrations are great because like we were saying, it's kind of like an unlimited recipe book of things that you can integrate to or create these triggers based off of actions that your customers are taking. And then autoresponder integrations is the last one. That's when you're actually using the email address and these different rules inside of Thrivecart to add or remove and do different things uh, based off of the actions they're taking inside of Thrivecart. So tons of options. And like we were saying, you can pretty much integrate with anything that you have out there using one of these four methods. And this is something that a lot of people don't realize. They realize or they think that it's only the ones that are natively integrated are what are allowed. But you have so many other options out there to really integrate anything you need. So just keep that in mind. And if you're not yet in on Thrivecart, right now is going to be the very best time to get in. At the time of this video, it's a one-time price. That's not going to be like that forever. And, and you know, if you get in before that changes into the monthly or annual fee, uh, you will get grandfathered in for all the different features that are coming out, big, big product updates and things like that. They're happening literally daily. <laughs> they release updates. They might not tell us all the time, uh, but they are. They release about 32 even more updates per day. Uh, per month. So you're getting grandfathered in for all that stuff. But not only that, you're going to get exclusive specials, bonuses, and things that are literally worth probably more than the actual software itself. So these are trainings and interviews and things to really get you up to speed, um, get your products created fast, and get them selling online quickly with Thrivecart. So go to getthrivecart.com to get access to all that stuff, get the best price for Thrivecart, and let's start profiting with this stuff online. Thanks for watching, and we'll talk soon.